So I'll move the selector switch to mag to measure the magnetic field. The LCD display comes to life. The big digits at the bottom here tell us the current field measurement reading for magnetic fields, which is shown in mg or milligauss. And above that is a bar graph here, which gives us the reading, the same reading in a bar form on a scale of 0 to 100. The top left we've got the peak measurement unit. This captures the highest peak in milligauss that has been measured and holds it for three seconds. And the icon at the bottom left tells us we've got the audio function switched on. The top right here we've got the battery level indicator. So here I've got an electric razor. Watch what happens as I switch this electric razor on. And as I move it away, the magnetic fields fall off. And if we move the selector switch to ELEC, so now we're measuring electric fields. The big digits at the bottom now tell us the current field measurement for electric fields. And you can see it's actually reacting to my finger. <laughs> um, and we have a reading in VM now and VM means volts per meter. Above that is the bar graph here, the bar graph again, which gives us the same information on a scale of zero to 100. Top left, we've got the peak measurement unit in VM, um, which tells the, the, the highest peak that's been measured and holds it for three seconds. And again, with the electric razor, we have a small, albeit smaller, uh, electric field uh, than previously but then there is nevertheless an electric field and then if we move the selector switch into the dark blue area then we move so the dark blue area here yes as opposed to the light blue area it's not very clear but um, there is a light blue and a dark blue so we're in the dark blue here and this tells us we're on the weighted mode so weighted yes on the weighted mode setting uh, for, for in this case magnetic fields um, and we have the same functionality for electric fields and this makes the meter more sensitive at frequencies higher than 60 Hertz as opposed to the standard mode which is what I was on before which measures the fields using a flat frequency response now that might sound a little bit confusing but there's more complete information on my website about this. And then if we move the selector switch to the far right where it says RF then we are now measuring radio frequency microwave radiation and the big digits are the big digits at the bottom here which is currently a zero um, that's giving us a reading in MW M squared which means milliwatts per square meter and again we have the peak measurement unit which is now operating in milliwatts per square meter also captures the highest peak that's been measured holds it for three secs the same as for the other modes so I've got a walkie-talkie here okay and I'm gonna switch this on well it's actually switched on I'm gonna press on the bottom to action it you're gonna watch what happens and we immediately get a signal and if I move it away even you see we get less of a signal and that's what radio frequency radiation sounds like on this meter and that's very simply how it works